Hi, this is a short video tour of uh, this uh, Mont Blanc Writer's Edition Franz Kafka um, set uh, that came out oh, maybe eight years ago. And I pulled them a little bit out of the case to make them easy to get to. It's uh, three. This is the uh, pencil uh, matching uh, ball ballpoint pen and really the the special one I think because I'm like a fountain pen kind of guy is the uh, fountain pen um, the fountain pen is round on this end and square on the other end while the others are square on the clip end and round on the other one could say that it changes from round to square or from square to round it metamorphoses um, so it's kind of a tribute to metamorphosis Franz Kafka's famous uh, short story um, and you can kind of see that semi translucent uh, finish that's really hard to photograph and it is a numbered set. I have some stills of the actual uh, serial number. I don't think we can... We need to try and get it to focus on that. There we go. So it is a numbered set. Let me open it up. Metamorphosis is a story about uh, this guy that turns into a roach. <laughs> so you can see this clip actually looks like a roach's leg. I believe it's designed to look that way. You can't post this square and round, square peg, round hole. So if you write with it, you'd write with it this way. Let me see if I can get a close-up on this. Yeah, can you see that roach on the nib? It's a gold nib, but it's uh, plated with uh, that, I think it's rhodium or something. And uh, another unusual thing is that, let me get this in focus. Sorry, I'm a real amateur, I'm sorry. I really apologize. There we go. One of the... the uh, Unique qualities of this writer's edition, I think it's the only one, or one of the only ones, not built on the uh, Model 146 um, platform. And what that means is that instead of a piston, it's, you can see that a piston would be very impossible to incorporate, and it would also cause a seam right over here to accommodate the blind cap. This uses a captive piston. This can't be removed. And uh, you have to leave it in, but this is a fairly large uh, captive converter piston. Really nice. And I have to sell it, so that's why I'm doing this. It, uh, I've had it for years. haven't used it because the the nib is a medium and uh, if you've seen my handwriting is very small I use an extra fine or a half millimeter uh, italic nib this is really nice anyway I just wanted to show you and of course it comes with the box let me take this out so I can show you the box the box itself looks like a book. I think that's really clever. And it uh, comes with the information on the uh, limited edition or writer's edition. I haven't opened this polishing cloth, so that's unopened. Um, but it has been used. All, all of the writing uh, instruments have been used very carefully and not very much. Uh, my handwriting changed. So I, really didn't use it much. This is the box. So you get the actual box, but you can see it's a little frayed, you know, right here at the edges. That's that's not too bad. And right here. So, uh, you know, if you're a 
fanatic on these things and that would uh, decrease the desirability the actual instruments themselves are are just flawless the uh, silver has a has a tendency to tarnish because it is silver and I polished them but I don't want to polish them a lot you know a lot of people like to uh, limit that sort of thing if you get it you can polish it yourself but these are all in very good com uh, condition all numbered um, and ready to go thank you very much